Now this is for all the wrestling fanatics around the world. Okay, if not, then this is not the video for you. Sorry to break it down like that. Anyway, if you watch Raw, the first part of Raw, it is pretty decent in my eyes. Now, if you watch this past Sunday, the Roblox, um, uh, Y2J screwed Roman to become Universal Champion and all that good stuff. And I really thought that, you know, the best friends, Y2J and KO, broke up in the middle of the show, but. They fool us in a heartbeat. Of course, eventually they're going to break up, but we don't know when. Um, so Mick Foley decided to have a rematch. When is this rematch going to take place? Next year. In San Antonio at the Royal Rumble for the Road to WrestleMania. The belt will be in line. For KO's belt, it's not title for title. I wish it was, but that'd be probably kind of dumb. Or maybe they done it once, and most likely Roman probably will lose the belt before Rumble, or probably will lose it on the road to WrestleMania. Who knows? Who cares? Here's the awesome thumbnail my friend named Tony Talent hooked me up with. Thanks, my man. You're the bomb diggity. And, um, all that good stuff. And that wraps it up with this freaking video. Just kidding. Um, I mentioned this a while back. They need to put, um, Y2J in the above a cage, then he won't interfere. They did it back in the day for Jim Cornette. I'm not too sure if you guys remember that. Probably the older fans remember that. I'm glad they finally done this. And he's going to be up there 20 feet in the air, you know? He's not afraid of heights. If he was, then it, he won't be part of this um, storyline. And we will have a different thing, you know? Now, the only way that Y2J could screw... Roman on the belt once again if someone backstage lower down the cage like they did back in the day. Let's do a little flashback. Um, it was King of the Ring 98. Probably a lot of you don't know what I'm talking about or maybe you do know. It's on a network. It was the McMahons in Austin and it was a, I think had the, the power to control of the W at the time, and I think someone backstage um, lowered down the briefcase and let the McMahons get it. And so that's possible for this match. And then I don't know who could do it. Maybe Seth. Maybe I don't know who could do it backstage, you know. Or maybe someone would just tease uh, Y2J up and down, you know, like a yo-yo. But this should be a good match. I am not gonna give you my prediction. This is not a prediction. This is just a preview. So sorry to give you upset. And um, I went to the Rumble this past year, or actually at the beginning of the year. Time goes so fast. Am I going this year? Not this year. Um, let's see what else matches they're gonna announce. I'm assuming they're gonna announce another match for. Um, SmackDown tonight for the Royal Rumble for the championship match for um, the SmackDown brand side for the Rumble. I might be right, I may, might be wrong, but hopefully it's going to be a good match, these two athletes, but I don't know, I'm just not really into their feud. This past Sunday was not that great, you know, too much um, wrestling on the ground, you know. I might be on the weird, but I prefer like a, a fast-paced match and not a very, very slow match, you know. I don't know if it's KO 
or is it Roman Reigns don't have great chemistry? Who knows? Who cares? Um, I think a lot of people th thinks that uh, before this match um, got announced that KO probably will lose the belt at the Rumble or on her way going to WrestleMania or he might headline WrestleMania as a champion still. Who knows? He hardly, W hardly let him defend it, you know? He just holds it around his waist like a little pretty boy. You know, that's how W does it these days, you know? I remember back in the day off the record, sorry, I love the guilt off the subject. When I was growing up, uh, the wrestlers used to have it around the waist, then they decided to put it on the shoulder, then they hold, hold it, you know? But I guess every wrestler is different, or every um, error is different, you know? But let's see what happens. I Hopefully no interference from someone backstage and start a new feud. Um, hopefully this will be a better match than the roadblock end of the line. Speaking of that, if you have never, not, not really, never, if you missed out on my review of this past Sunday, don't worry. Probably you scroll above the screen, you can check it out for yourself. Um, the Rumble, it, it's a good event, you know? It's been a long, it's been a while, it's been there for a long time since, what, 88? Um, that's all I gotta say, really. Do you think Y2J is really scared? Uh, no. Well, he can always use a list and whatever. Or maybe if he has his phone, they could do like um, Facebook Live or something like that. That'd be pretty epic on his and how he feels about it. That'd be pretty cool. Maybe they put a camera in the cage like they did to Jim Cornette back in the day and uh, Paul Bearer. Back in the day, rest in peace, Paul Bearer. I know I totally botched his name, but you know I'm going with this. Anyway, this is your friend here. You know who this is. This wraps it up. All my social media accounts are down below. Have a great rest of your Tuesday. And i talk to you on the flip side. Sayonara and peace out. This should be a barber. Let's see what happens with this matchup.